internet friends, welcome to another episode of the Synergy Cafe online show featuring speaker, entertainer, close-up illusionist, and marketing alchemist, Magic Brad. It's the internet lifestyle show about career, finance, relationships, spirituality, and wellness. We're moving the online chatter over to real life activity. And now, please welcome your host of Synergy Cafe, Magic Brad. Hey, Internet friend, this is Magic Brad with Synergy Cafe and the Synergy Collaborative, and I have a, a guest, and he was on before, and he's on again. His name is Peter. You there, Peter? Yes, sir. I'm right here. Yay! It took us a little bit of work and effort to get through, but perseverance, you know? Yeah, and especially when things are working. It helps. <laughs> that's that's part of the job. So let's get to know who you are. You What, what part of the country are you in? Uh, I'm in Atlanta, Georgia. Atlanta, that's right. See, I should remember all that stuff. And I don't recall, are you married and you got kids and all that kind of stuff? Yep, married almost 20 years, three kids, 17, 15, and 14. How long you lived in Atlanta? Just about that long, just about 20 years. <laughs> Actually, that's when I moved here, when uh, when I got married. I remember right uh, we lived in Asheville, North Carolina for a while, and uh, there was a big old ice storm, and I remember everything just shut down. It took people like eight hours to get from Atlanta back to, to Asheville. It was... Yeah, everything shuts down here. They really don't even have too much equipment to move anything. So, <laughs> yep, that's exactly what happens. We can take care of that up here in Minneapolis. No problem. There you go. <laughs> I, I, I always tell people, you don't have to shovel sunshine. So I like it here. <laughs> there you go. I understand. Well, so let's get right into what it is that you do to occupy yourself. What is your, uh, what, what's your gig? Sure. Well, obviously, my name is Peter Vexelman. I'm a real estate investor. I've been investing successfully for 15, right about 15 years. You know, bought over 3,000 properties. Uh, average week here in Atlanta office, I do about 10 deals a week. I also have offices throughout uh, the rest of the country, all the way from Florida to Texas to California, collectively doing about 50 deals a week between all my offices in terms of my investment portfolio and, and, uh, and also my real claim to fame is I also have a traditional real estate brokerage with real real estate agents. So we've actually combined the two, and that's how we go to the market. We basically empower the sellers by giving them options. If option A, we could actually buy their property, or if that does not work, then we can help them list the property. So that model is just absolutely taken off by storm, and that's why we're growing by leaps and bounds all over the place here. So then you help other people get into what it is that you're doing successfully? Absolutely. I also have a coaching program where people can find out more about me at coachingbypeter.com. Uh, that's for people who are aspire to be real estate investors, or there you are, investors and are looking to move up the food chain to get their businesses bigger and better and better. Uh, I work with individuals like that literally all over the United States and help them so, develop. Their so, say there's a, so there's a so say there's a guy that has a job and he's got this entrepreneurial spirit. He's always wanted to kind of get out of his job, and he lives in a house. And so you can kind of help him say, you know, maybe what you ought to do is maybe move into a duplex and rent out half of it. Yeah, is that the kind of thing that you do? Yeah, yeah, that's that's uh, yeah, yeah, that's like a kindergarten way of doing things. But uh, <laughs> but in a sense, yeah, but the guy's got a job. It don't matter where he lives. Uh, but he says, listen, I want more of a job. I want to one day be able to get out of here, and you know, I want to enjoy freedom. I want to be my own real estate investors. You know, I show them how to how to do that. Exactly right. Well, when people like me get into this kind of thing, you got to start at the kindergarten level. I never bought a house before, and when I got married, and I, I didn't get married till I was fifty. Three, mm. and I bought my first house. My my house that I lived in was my parents, and there was just willed to me and my brother. But that's a lot of paperwork and all those terms like escrow and points and all that mm. stuff, and it makes you crazy. So it's nice to be able to have someone like you that can explain that kind of stuff, and mm. and maybe you can say, yeah, this isn't the house for you because there's not enough margin in it. So maybe you should back off and. Find something new because that's what I do. I mean, I take people sucked. from 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 zero to hero. You know, show them how to put deals together, how to structure deals. You know, usually can get them profitable in the first couple of months. You know, goals then to get them out of their jobs, replace their incomes a couple of months afterwards. So yeah, people that want to work with me, they start part time, but the goal for them is you know they aspire to be successful investors, and that's that's my kind of bullseye client. Well, it makes a lot of sense. Me and a friend of mine, he's got a big background in real estate, and that's what he does is generate leads for real estate agents and things like that. But him and I are working on some stuff where you can leverage your money to start working for you, and that's kind of what you're talking about, the Robert Kiyosaki kind of thing of being an investor rather than an employee kind of mindset. Is that correct? Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. The real estate is all about leverage. Now, the, the typical what people think about leverage is, is money, and that's correct. You know, You could leverage money. 
But the great thing about real estate is that it allows you to leverage so many other things. It allows you to leverage time, allows you to re leverage resources, allows you to leverage other people. It's though it's that side of the leverage that really allows you to create a, a lifestyle. And then the job, you know, I don't care how much money you make, you're probably the more you make, the harder you work. In real yep. estate, the more successful you get and the more you leverage other things other than just the money side, that's where you start buying back your own time and you know, start creating a lifestyle for yourself. Well, even the taxes and stuff like that, if you're in the business of what you're doing, when you go and put new siding on a house, that's all a tax deductible business expense, right? Yep. The yep. like tax that. code is set up for, for, for business owners, as you know. It's not up, set up for W-2 employees. So yeah, okay. absolutely. It's another sideline benefit. You know, as you get us to be an, an investor, you know, you have the the ability to, to take advantage of the kind of write-ups you would never be able to take advantage of otherwise. So I've got some money in REITs, which is a real estate investment trust. Mm -hmm. So that's sort of real estate investing, but I don't really touch it. I just let it ride. It's in, in a lot of different properties. It's in mm -hmm. uh, residential, commercial, storage lockers, apartments, shopping centers. It also gets into resorts and things like that. Do you get into like resort properties in exotic locations like in Tulum, Mexico or anything like that? No, no, that's definitely a niche type of a deal. You know, my yeah. my my bread butter is just regular real estate that you find anywhere. You know, houses could be small apartments, could be tracts of land. Uh, but just real estate, stuff. or just uh, yeah. residential? Mostly about eighty percent residential and about twenty percent other various things like commercial apartments, you know, land stuff like that. Yeah, I, walking around downtown Minneapolis once in a while, you see these big warehouses that are empty, and you wonder why. And it's because there's a coffee shop on the bottom that's paying for everything. They've got all that space. And you wonder, why don't they rent out this space? Because they don't have to. <laughs> that's exactly right. All the it's a beautiful thing about real estate. I mean, when you really start understanding the, the dynamics of what it offers, there's nothing out there to like it. Nothing so like tell it. us again exactly how to get a hold of you, your website name and things like that. Then I want to ask you the big why question. Sure. It's uh, Coaching by Peter, www.coachingbydypeter.com. There they can go. Learn more about me. Learn more about how I can help them become more successful in this industry. Well, that's easy enough to remember. Coaching by Peter. That's I love it. it. So here's my big why question. That's the reason. The question is why. Why are you doing this? Why aren't you like a basketball coach or a, a gym instructor? Or why didn't you get into opening a restaurant? Why did you choose this industry and this business to be in? Sure. Well, number one, it comes down to talent. You know, that's where this is where my strength is. The, the, the strengths that I possess as, a, as an individual lend itself to being a real estate investor, you know, lends itself to this type of a career, lends itself to this type of an industry. Uh, but why do I do it now at the levels I do it? We are literally disrupting the market. We are changing the way real estate is looked at by going through this un very unusual approach of letting the, con we're giving the, we're putting the, the value add right to the consumer, right to the seller, letting them determine what do they do? Do they want to do a quick sale to an investor, maybe get a little bit less money, but more predictable, more vanilla kind of a closing? Or do they want to go to traditional route, the retail route, where a regular real estate agent lists their property? Look, they can make a little bit more money, but it takes a little bit more time and all this. But, 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 but the bottom line is, why do I do this? We are disrupting the market. We are changing the way real estate is being done all over the country. I mean, I feel passionately about this, and I'll tell you, in the next couple of years, I, I feel like this is the way that real estate is going to be done. So I love doing what I'm doing. We're, we're making a difference out there. Got it. So that's a, that's always good to know. You look sounds like you're looking to help people, and it sounds like what you're doing is kind of blending that brokerage thing in with the agent thing. Whereas when an agent sells a house, they're just kind of looking to get their points and get their commission. And they're off with it. And the same thing with a broker. Yep. But you're kind of blending the two together in sort of a absolutely just yep. we're very cool the consumer. Absolutely, I love it. Well, thanks, Peter, for taking the day today on Synergy Cafe. I'm going to beam this up to the internet, and we'll get it out and propagate it out. And if you could do the same, that would be wonderful. Awesome. Hey, I enjoyed it. Talk to you soon, Brad. Okay, thanks. Peace.